Well, well, well. I am here, and so are you. Thank you, as always, YouTubers, for being here today. I really appreciate it. I'm going to answer a question that so many people never ask me, and that is, what would you buy if you were a pay-to-play player? If you did spend money on this game, what would you buy? No one's ever asked me that, but here's my answer anyway. When it comes to spending money, I'm, I'm just not a gambler, which, which is odd because I love this game and it's all RNG. You never know what you're going to get. So with that being said, if I was to spend money, what packs are the most interesting to me? For me, what I would have to say uh, starting off would just be Devil Mons because these are rare. You get one, you know, from Arena uh, every week. You get TOA. You get a Devil Mon there. TOA hard. If you can get up there, you get another Devil Mon. Um, so these, you know, it would be great to have more Devil Mons because we all have units we would like to to fully skill up. And the the idea of like gambling with these, I mean, sure, they could go into skill one, which is probably not ideal, but these make the most sense to me right your units get stronger when you skill them up so i don't know i don't like to gamble the fact that casinos are a thing blows my mind and that people go to them and spend their money and then they hate themselves because they wasted all their money i can see devil mons as being a decent investment if you were to buy a pack that's probably what i would be most tempted by when it comes to runes obviously runes are the most important thing in this game if you ever ask the question, how do I improve my account? Uh, farm more runes. That's just what, that's the answer always is farm more runes, uh, get better runes. That's the answer until this game shuts down. And even then you'll probably dream of rune farming in your sleep. So buying rune packs look super tempting. It's like, oh, legend guaranteed blessed rune box. Oh, you get, you know, Look at these runes you could get. You get 15 hero runes and like, oh, great. But I know me. If I was to buy this pack, I would get flat attack slot two and then I would cry. I just know that that's how it would go. I mean, sure, 2,800 crystals. Okay, cool. Like at least I get that, right? But that's not the whole idea of this pack. The, the Why you buy this pack is to have the runes. So... I, I, I just could not, I would be so mad at myself if I spent a hundred bucks to get just terrible runes with flat substats, with the wrong percentage runes that I was looking for. I just know me, right? Comment, comment below your experience with buying packs in, in Summoner's War. Was it good? Did it work? Do you regret it? Let me know in the comments down below. Even if you buy rune packs, you're still going to have to farm runes anyway, because that's just what this game is about. So I just don't see the point in spending money on these, but I could be wrong. Maybe these are great. Maybe rune packs are awesome. I just, you're going to have to farm them anyway. I don't know. If I was to start, you know, a new count and, and make a video series, like, you know, my first pay account. I, I, I think years ago, I spent five bucks to buy the starter pack, but that's it. I've only spent $5 on this game total throughout all the years. If I was to make a video series that was like, you know, I spent money on this account. Starter starter packs are great. Um, they just give you an extra start to the game. So that would be nice. If I, if I was to do that, I could see buying these would be a, a decent ideal, decent idea. See, this pack is interesting. It ends soon, apparently. Um, it's a dollar. I have never, I haven't seen Summoner's War charge a dollar for anything. You get four star times four Rainbow Mon. Okay, you can make a five star unit, whatever. Uh, Angel Mon for a dollar. Right, that's not bad, right? Eh. Okay, I mean, you can easily make four four star monsters in the blink of an eye just by playing the game anyway. But for a dollar, okay, not bad, not bad. Why is this in the game? Why? What? Are people... I don't get it. 
Are people dying to just awaken their units right away that they have to spend $30? Oh my god, I need, to, I need to awaken this unit. I don't want to farm 20 high essences to awaken this unit. I'm going to buy 30 bucks. Boom. Is that a thing? Do people buy this often? Do you buy this often? I don't know. To me, this is dumb. This is dumb, right? Just farm the dungeon and you'll get your high essences, that, right? Especially if you use this on a three-star monster, you deserve to uh, give me all your money. If you use this on a three-star monster, just go ahead. PayPal me all of your money because you're irresponsible i this one i don't know i mean free room removal comes around every month i don't know why you would need another one of these in between the month i i i don't fully this is better obviously than the awakening pack but still in the same vein of how much improvement are you going to make in, in the like the middle of the month versus when you actually did it on free room removal day right do you need these do people buy these often i don't know let me know summoning scrolls okay the legendary all attribute scroll right you can get uh a four star four to five star water fire wind light and dark right all attributes are on the table for seventy dollars oh my gosh 70 that's a lot of money and 15 mystical scrolls 1800 crystals okay uh, i would have to say i am least tempted by the scrolls i would much rather buy devilmons and in, in rune packs than i would scrolls i i just like when the transcendent scrolls come around i get the temptation be like oh it's a guaranteed nat five okay you pull in at five and then you don't have double mons to rune it up and you don't have adequate runes to put on the unit and then you're like okay well like i guess i'll use this unit down the road at some point later i just don't get it i am i am not tempted at all by scrolls uh just because i know runes are way more important than than the units that you get so i don't know I get the draw, obviously, because you want the shiny units. You want to have that rush of getting a nat 5. Sure, it makes sense. To me, I, I, I'm not tempted by that. I would much rather pull great runes than I would great units. That's just how I feel in my in my brain. Um, Let's say I get an LD5. And I'm just like, wow, yeah. Like bragging rights. But is that worth $70? Oh my goodness gracious. Packs like these, I guess these are okay. Um, I mean, you get a, anything with the Devilmon in it, I'm a fan of. Any event that comes out that has a Devilmon in it, I, I like. I just need thousands of Devilmons, right? Everybody does. Reap stones, those are, those are nice, or they can be nice, right? It's all RNG. I don't care for the light and dark scroll, um, but... I, I don't know packs like these where you get a lot of different stuff i mean they're pretty cool like this one you get some legend runes like like dark Scrolls. i don't super care about you get some grindstones like you just get more for your money than just like a legendary scroll these are kind of like a hodgepodge of stuff so these are okay i guess still a hundred bucks wow hundred dollars wow this pack is just infuriating. You get five star level one rainbow mon. You get four of them. You don't even have enough. You buy this, you can't even make a six star. That's infuriating to me. It's just like a tease. It's like, oh, hey, do you almost want to make a six star unit? We'll buy this pack. I'm like what? Make it, make it, make it five. I'm giving you 20 bucks. You can at least help me six star unit right why are you giving me four you just that's just greedy it's just greedy oh it's so dumb but it's still better than this pack this pack sucks again if i was to start a new account and make it like a, a pay series this would be great um as you level up you get more and more stuff to help your account progress faster that's pretty dope uh i can get why people get these i don't know why it only goes up to level 40 is there another one that goes up to level 50 after you buy this one? I don't know. I'm sure there is. 
because it's growth package one where's growth package two the summoning stone packs okay if there is a specific unit that you're trying to go for obviously the summoning stones are your best shot like let's say there was a lucian in the summoning stones i'm like bob saget i need a lucian i still don't have one on my account i want a lucian i can see the temptation to buy the summoning stones to try to get that unit um the this makes logical sense to me because at least you know there's a chance that you can get that unit it's right in front of you it's not like buying mystical scrolls where you literally get whatever like these you're picking from like a select group but even still like i said the summoning stuff doesn't doesn't tempt me as much the scrolls they don't tempt me as much as the devilmon packs and the in the rune packs do um because again let's say you you buy this you get lucian and you're like great i, I finally got him i spent a hundred bucks to get lucian uh, and you have just n subpar attack crit damage runes to put on them. Like, great. You got them. Eww. Spending money for mana stones. Mana stones. Okay. No. No. Uh, you get 2,800 crystals, sure. All right. But the main point of this pack is the mana stones? Heck, you're gonna go through. You're gonna go through that so fast, just powering up runes. I don't know. I would not spend a hundred bucks on mana stones. I, I <laughs> no. I I would not. I'm sorry. I would not. Transmogs? No. Ugh, no. They cool. They look cool, right? No. 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 And I don't understand why would you spend like money on these piles of crystals. When all of the other packs I showed you get you get crystals from them anyway, along with other things. This costs 30 bucks to buy, let's say 750 crystals for 30 bucks. If I go over here, 750 crystals. Okay, they don't have a specific pack for that, but for 20 bucks you get 500 crystals. And that's it. Why would you not buy another pack where you get other stuff? Why are these in the game? Why are these in the game? Why are these in the game? Dumb. Stupid. So that's it. I don't know. So if I answered the question, Devilmons and Rune Packs would be what I would buy. There's no point in trying to get all the best units if your runes are subpar. And that's how I feel about it. Thanks for being here. As always, thank you so much for your time, your attention. Subscribe if you want to. Like the video if you liked it. And I'll see you in the next one. This is Uncle Nay, signing off.